The next important question from chapter transpiration is mention whether the following statements are true or false. So the first statement is transpiration is not controlled by anatomy of the transpiring organ. Means they are asking if there is any relation between the anatomy of transpiring organ and rate of transpiration. So as there is direct relation, uh, so this statement is false as number of stomata, the thickness of cuticle, the number of lenticels on the plants will directly affect the rate of transpiration. Now the next statement is the loss of liquid water from the margin of a leaf is called translocation. Now again this statement is false as the loss of water from the margin is called as guttation and translocation is the term related to phloem, transportation of nutrients which are dissolved in the phloem. The next statement is water mainly ascends the stem due to osmosis. Now again this statement is false because the ascending of sap in xylem are due to transpiration, pull, root pressure, capillary action. But osmosis is related to the absorption of water from the soil by the roots. Now the next statement is the rate of transpiration will decrease if air temperature decreases. This statement is completely true as there is direct relationship between temperature and rate of transpiration. As temperature increase, the rate of transpiration will also increase. The next statement is cobalt chloride paper on contact with moisture turns pink. As you know that this statement is true because anhydrous cobalt chloride paper is blue in color and as this paper absorbing moisture it will turn its color from blue to pink.